Welcome to the Homes on Wheels Alliance YouTube channel. I'm Sue Ann Carlson, the Executive Director of Homes on Wheels Alliance, otherwise known by the acronym of HOWA, H-O-W-A. I have a co-founder of HOWA, and his name is Bob Wells of Cheap RV Living and Nomad Land fame. Last year, Bob moved into an ambulance and donated his van to HOWA to put on a sweepstakes to raise funds for the work that we do. Thank you so much, Bob. In this video, a volunteer named Glenn discusses how he spent last fall spiffing up Bob's van for the winner of that sweepstakes. The sweepstakes for Bob's van is on February 2nd, 2022 at 2 p.m. Pacific time. And it will be on the Cheap RV Living YouTube channel live. So be sure to watch it. The last day to buy tickets is on January 26, 2022. This is a sweepstakes, so no purchase is necessary. To enter and win, you must be 18 years or older. The complete rules and directions on how to enter, either by donation or as a free entry, are at the webpage howa.rallyup.com slash Bob's van. Now, let's meet Glenn and check out Bob's spiffed up van. I'm Glenn. I'm one of the many volunteers of Howa, Home on Wheels Alliance. And my task over the last six weeks has been to prepare Bob Wells' van to have it ready for the new recipient on the drawing in February. Well, one of the many projects that I participated in is to prepare the high top with a new coat of gel coat wherever it was accessible. So underneath the panels, it hasn't been recoded, but everywhere else, it, and it should give it many more years of longevity. Also on top, you'll see the hood. The hood is, is new along with the vent underneath it. These are Bob Wells' original panels and it's grouped in two pairs. So the first two I called panel A and the second panel B. That'll all come together when we move inside. The panel B set, all the connectors, all the CM4s have been replaced. So you're all good to go. And panel set A was working functionally fine when I, when I started work on the project. Well, welcome to the inside of Bob's van. Lots of changes have happened. We've added insulation and coated it with epoxy resin. The epoxy resin is washable. This condensation can be an issue for, for van dwellers. So it gives it a hardness and it ties it all cohesively together. Moving down, we have cushions. Type insulation that's been placed on four sides, including the angle that separates the cap from the living compartment. And my head is very thankful for the cushion because I've hit it without the cushion many of times and had to heal from it many of times. Seems like as soon as it healed, I injured it again. So the new owner won't have to worry about that. Now you can see we installed a LED light. It has two sets of lights. Single light can be put on or double lights. It has a switch in the center. And we have a brand new vent. It's a Max, Max Air vent and hood. And uh, that's about all I can say about that. So I'm standing on the brand new floor. All the furniture was removed. Everything was thoroughly cleaned. And the new vinyl floor was set in place and the furniture brought in. Well, now we're in the cab and we're going to talk about the house electric. We start off with the original four batteries that Bob Wells did a video on. And as you can see, the electrical has changed quite a bit, the wiring at least. We start off with the main and then it splits off to the charging side and the load side so over here is the charging side 
positive and negative, and here's the load side, positive and negative. The load side is switched. You saw the switch at the very top. So you can isolate the load completely if you're doing diagnostic work or if you're leaving the van somewhere and you don't want any load on the batteries, you can just flip the switch and it's done. Back in the living compartment. And we're gonna talk about the show end of the house electronics. So we start off, let's start off at the charging part. So we have two charge controllers, charge controller A, which matches panel A, panel set, and charge controller B, which is the rear set of panels. Charge controller A also has a remote that gives voltage and amps. And as we move down, we have the 2000 watt inverter and a 4000 watt inverter. Not quite finished, but we're going to have a fuse box block forward and in the rear. Thank you, Glenn, for giving of your time and your skills to make Bob's van in great condition for the winner of the sweepstakes. The sweepstakes drawing is on February 2nd, 2022. The last day to get tickets is on January 26, 2022. You can watch the drawing on Cheap RV Living's YouTube channel live on February 2nd, 2022 at 2 p.m. Pacific time. This is a sweepstakes, so no purchase is necessary to enter, but you must be 18 years or older. Complete rules and instructions about how to enter, either by donation or as a free entry, are at the website howa.rallyup.com slash Bob's Van. Good luck, and thank you for supporting Howa's work to help nomads in need.